Hey there, Cody from IT here for another Tech Tip Tuesday. Today I'm going to show you how to create comments in Google Docs using a screen reader. Now if your organization uses Google Workspace, making comments on Google Docs is pretty important. It can be used to either give feedback to your student from their teacher, or if you're in the workplace, to give feedback to a colleague on their document. Now we are showing you how to create comments before we show you how to read comments. So that might seem a little counterintuitive, but creating comments in Docs is so much easier than reading comments in Docs. We're gonna be going over reading comments in next week's video. So I have a Google Doc open here, and I'm gonna show you how to make a comment on it. Now the first step is I need to select the text that I'm going to make a comment on. Now if you don't know how to select text, that is totally fine. Take a look at our newest course in the screen reader curriculum, Working with Text. In one of the modules in that course, we show you how to select text step by step. The link is in the description. So I'm going to select some text here. Here we go. This selected, map selected, of selected, the selected, as 10 was in one, so in near, select, Germany selected. And that's, that's good, right? And I'm going to make a comment on this text that I just selected. Now, making a comment is so easy. It's one key command. It's Control, Alt, and M for make a comment. Let me try it. List, dialog, input pane grouping, comment draft edit has autocomplete multi-line comment or add others with. Now, once you do Control, Alt, M, you're put into an edit field where you can type your comment. Let me type it. Space, 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 G O O D S I D E A. This is a good idea, right? Pretty simple. Now you have one more step left. Ready? You are going to tab to the comment button. Post comment button. There it is. And once you're there, press enter. Document selected. Comment created document region. Document content edit multi line selected this map of the Aztec. And now my comment is created. It's pretty easy, right? Now remember, these videos are for learners that already know these basic text skills, right? Skills like placing your cursor or selecting text or reading text, right? Now if that's not you, don't stress yourself out trying to get through this video. Instead, go back to basics, take a look at our newest course in the screen reader curriculum. It's called Working with Text. And in that course, we show you step by step how to get started working with text. That's reading, writing, and editing text. And then once you've done that course, you can come back here and learn some of these more advanced skills. Take a look at the link in the description. It's a really awesome course. Now, if you liked today's video, you're definitely going to need next week's video. In order to get it, make sure you hit subscribe and the notifications button below. That way, once we release that video, it pops up in your timeline. Thank you so much for joining us this week. As always, we'll see you next week for another Tech Tip Tuesday.